One of the common questions that is asked is, suppose I want to go from a demo account to a live account and I want to use the existing setup from the demo account uh, so that I don't have to do any extra work. And that's a, a fairly easy solution. Uh, what we're looking at here is the demo account that we have set up for the Flap Turbo demo. And if we wanted to go live, what you simply have to do is take the profile of the existing demo account and save it out under a new name and then be able to use that same setup with the live account. So the only thing that we're doing is, is creating a new account or using our new account username and password which is a number plus the password in order to use the existing profile from the demo to the live account. So as you can see on the bottom here, my demo account I use Flap Turbo as the name for this profile. So if I click on that on the bottom, <clears throat> it pops up. And if I save as the profile, I can rename it. I don't want to name it the same thing just in case I want to go back and change something. So if I do Flap Turbo Live then I would save the existing profile as live, as the Flap Turbo Live. And then all I'd have to do is go up to my account and where it says log in, I would actually type in the new account number and the password and of course change this from demo to live. And that's what would happen. Your live account information would pop up on the screen with the existing charts and the existing profile. Now when you do that, obviously you're going to have to resave that Flap Turbo Live profile once again in order to capture the live account with the old information under the new name of Flap Turbo. And basically that's how you do it. It's very simple. You use the existing profile from the demo into your live account. Now for most of our VPN, BPS users, uh, we set up two accounts for each particular broker. So why don't you take your demo account first and use that to set up the live account and then go to the second folder and take the account number and password from the demo and insert it in that new one. And basically you should be able to uh, recreate your demo and keep your existing demo as well. And that's it. Short and sweet. Wishing all of you the best of goodbyes.